So I uh, I haven't thought about it in years, but it is a true fact that for about five minutes, I was in Eagle Scouts or Boy Scouts or some kind of Scouts thing as a kid. Yeah. I totally, I, I haven't thought about that fact in forever. Like forever. Because, I mean, like, it was like so brief because obviously it was like my parents are like, this kid's weird. We got to like toughen him up or like make a man out of him or whatever the hell they thought. And they're like, yeah, yeah, scouts, that'll, that'll do it. Obviously, uh, their attempt at uh, normalizing me failed utterly and completely, which I'm super glad about that. But, you know, they, I was in it. I was in it. Do I remember anything about it? No, but I was in it. I was in it. So, uh, this is a story. Multiple Alabama teens to be part of nation's first class of female Eagle Scouts because... Uh, As it says here in the article, uh, the Boy Scouts of America opened to both genders in February 2019, and over 31,000 young women have joined the ranks of the organization since that time. Uh, Blah, 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 blah. So it goes on to say that. My opinion on this, I don't give a fuck. I I, I, I personally don't see how anyone could conceivably give a fuck. It's just like, who cares? Like, who the fuck even could bring themselves to even kind of sort of maybe care a little bit. Uh, You'd have to have some kind of really pathetic existence to, like, have an opinion on that. Like, forget negative opinion, just an opinion. Um, But, you know, uh, there's people with opinions, strong ones. So check it out. So here is uh, a, uh, a girl, I guess, uh, who's uh, talking about uh, being proud of her niece. Uh, 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 I am proud of my wonderful niece for her hard work, joining her father and her brother as an Eagle Scout. I'm also disgusted by the sicko adults who've been rude as hell in this thread. So uh, an example of one of those adults probably is the guy responding to her here. He says, a difference of opinion isn't rude unless you're a snowflake Marxist hell-bent on destroying American and Western culture. (laughs) Oh, yeah. Mm. (laughs) I love it, man. I love it, dude. Uh, Hey, please don't, like, attack these children. What are you, some kind of Marxist hell-bent on destroying our way of life? It's like, well, if your way of life is going on the internet and like, these fucking Girl Scouts are pieces of shit destroying our country. Like, if that's your way of life, then yes, it probably should be fucking destroyed, I would say. Probably pretty fair. Um, Here's some more. Kind of a queer slant makes everything crooked, one. I think that one is supposed to be an exclamation, probably. Um... Yeah, I guess. Okay, everything's crooked now because queer, I get it. It's like, oh, oh, it's queer. Okay, queer is slant. Slant, get it? Slant, crooked, queer slant. Crooked, crooked, get it? Maybe this will help stop the molest station going on. (laughs) I love how that's two words. Like, Like it's a place. Like the Neverland Ranch or something. Uh, The girls can report inappropriate behavior of the leaders and maybe some of the gay guys will just quit having to be around cute girls. There's so much weird pathology going on here, man. Like this dude is like literally thinks that it's just like a bunch of fucking gay dudes in the scouts. They're just like, oh yeah, yeah, the boy flesh. (laughs) Ooh. Uh oh, girls are allowed in? Ugh, gross. Not my scouts. I'm out of here. This guy, this is like perfect example of horseshoe theory, man. He's gone so far right that he actually agrees with what the left is doing, I guess. If, like, this isn't even the left or whatever, I don't think, but whatever. Um, no, this is a disgrace. There are distinct differences between a boy and a girl. They had their separate organizations until the psycho sick libtards got hold of it. Such a shame. I mean, like, boys and girls go to school together. 
You know, like they do. A, there's like plenty of stuff that's co-ed. You know what I mean? Like we don't separate the genders for most stuff. So I don't know why like scouts was this sake. Oh no. Learning how to like camp and fish and shit. No, that's fucking too much. Can't have that. That needs gender segregation for fuck's sake. Uh, the boy scouts has never been about families to participate together. It's about helping raise good, virtuous, moral, God-fearing men. They're in very low supply nowadays. Oh, yeah, nowadays. Fucking damn you nowadays. Why? Why? Um, why don't you want to raise virtuous, moral, God-fearing women? Like, isn't that a th- like a thing too? Wouldn't you want that? Just further destruction of customs that made America great. I'm glad I grew up when I did. Poor children are so confused now because weirdo adults can't figure out that a man has a pee-pee and a woman doesn't. Quit trying to convince people that nature has been wrong all these years. This is sick. This is not even like, this person's treating this like, like this is a trans issue. This is not even anything to do with that. This is just, this is not saying like, this is not even to, to do with like girls identify as boys. Like all the, this like this is about girls who identify as girls being in the scouts. They're not even like, we're boys. They're just like, we want to be in boy scouts because it shouldn't be a gendered organization. That's it. <laughs> So this argument you're making is weird. I mean, even if they, if, even if it was about trans people, super regressive, lame argument, but it's not even about that. So not only is it super lame and regressive, but it's just fucking wrong. Um, this whole thing about having gays and girls in the Boy Scouts of America is a political agenda, which is the destruction of American culture done mostly by the left's favorite means, the courts. No court mandated this, by the way. Its goal is to force acceptance of a Marxist globalist agenda and destroy traditional roles and values in the Boy Scouts of America. Why do you have to, um, like, okay, so draw me the line here. So girls and gays in scouts, then question mark, question mark, question mark, then globalist Marxist society. Like, we're, you know, I, I don't see it. Like, give, there's a lot of fuck. I feel like there's a lot of steps in between, like, put these girls in the Boy Scouts and then, 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 and Unless you, you got, like, if you're going to sh- sh- like, walk us through the fucking procedure, brah. Walk us through. Unfreaking believable. What is wrong with us? There is no shame in our country anymore. This is just so wrong. Why? <laughs> What's so wrong about it? What's going to happen? I am 72 years old and I am an Eagle Scout. How in the hell can it be the Boy Scouts if girls are awarded the rank of Eagle? This political correctness will ruin our society. There are definite roles for males and females. Contrary to popular belief, these roles do not compete with each other. They complement each other. This is a boneheaded idea and should not go forward. Yes, finally, a 72-year-old man that still identifies as a fucking Eagle Scout because that's the last time he accomplished anything in life is going to lecture us all on how things ought to be. You know, you need to be in this role and you need to be in this role because that's how the world works together. And only that world can work. And no other ideas could possibly exist in the world except for mine, mine, mine. Well, now that's just great. They should be ashamed of themselves and not invade the boys' scouts. Nothing to be proud about. Tisk tisk tisk. These fucking girls. What nerve. <laughs> hmm. They all look like girl scouts to me. Well, they're not. They're boy scouts, so fuck you. <laughs> Once again, who cares? 
I don't care. I think that uh, organizations like this are fucking stupid personally, but the fact that they're letting in both fucking genders or all genders or whatever the fuck, like, don't bother me none. Don't even bother me a little goddamn bit. None of my fucking business, as a matter of fact. That organization can do whatever the fuck it wants to do. Uh, I personally think it's just meaningless structure, bunch of fucking bullshit designed to, you know, we're going to make you better people or whatever. No, they're not. No, they're not. They're just going to fucking pin a bunch of dumb badges to a sash, and I feel special, whatever. If you're into it, if you're into it, you're into it. I personally don't give a fuck. But, like, this whole idea that this is, like, they're letting in girls and it's the fucking collapse of Western civilization. Like, is there anything fucking for conservatives that isn't the fucking collapse of Western civilization? That's my question. Is there anything so fuck, like, is there no minor grievance that you motherfuckers won't blow up to the fucking, it's the end of Western civilization. It's the beginning of the rise of the Marxist fucking regime. That's, it's the beginning of a new global order, like, Come on, guys. You can't fucking turn everything into that. It can't always be that. Some shit. I'm like, <laughs> oh, girls and scouts. Well, I think that's stupid. I don't like it. But like, it, okay, fine. I still think that's moronic take, but whatever. You're free to have your opinion. But like, these motherfuckers don't just stop there. It's always the end of the fucking world. It's always the end of our way of life. And by the way, what's so fucking great about Western civilization and our way of life that we need to wring our fucking hands about this, huh? Is it really so fucking awesome? Like, have you driven around this country? It's just fucking like a C to C shopping mall. I think George Carlin made that observation. Fucking McDonald's arches, fucking every town. Go to a fucking next town. McDonald's arches, McDonald's Burger King subway, McDonald's Burger King subway, McDonald's Burger King subway. Same fucking miserable people, fucking crumbling infrastructure, fucking political division, racial division, gender division, 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 strife, chaos, people at each other's fucking throats from sea to fucking shining sea. And it's like, well, we wouldn't want to risk, we wouldn't want to lose that. We wouldn't want to fucking rock that boat because everything's just fucking amazing. It's like, no, it's not. Maybe it's time for some new fucking ideas to rise up. But this isn't even that. This isn't even that. This isn't even a new idea rising up. It's just a fucking meaningless change to the policy of an organization that most people on a day-to-day -day basis don't give a fuck about. The fucking scouts. Who gives a shit? <sighs> I'm the Amazing Atheist. Peace the fuck out.